This video is brought to you by Squarespace, the all-in-one platform for all your website needs. Have you ever wondered what $1,104 worth of resin looks like? I don't need to anymore because we have it right here. But we're gonna be putting all of this resin to a very important scientific experiment. Yes, we are on a quest to preserve a pumpkin in resin forever. We wanna see if resin is truly the eternal fountain of life when it comes to vegetables. <laughs> Two years ago, we tried to make a jack-o'-lantern that defied death and lived forever by coating him in a shell of resin. <gasps> it didn't go super well. <laughs> but we didn't give up. For our second attempt, we dehydrated the pumpkin first and then coated him with resin. But the end result wasn't what we were hoping for. Well, we still haven't given up. So we're gonna be carving two pumpkins today. One will be the control, and the other will be embedded in a giant cube of resin. The biggest single pour we've ever done. But first let's do an update on Bean, AKA our dehydrated resin covered pumpkin that's been sitting in our closet for a year. He double bagged him. I'm sure he hasn't juiced all over our closet. Let's go see how he's doing. Don't mind this. Don't mind that. That's just another abomination of nature, yeah. okay? I'm nervous. How's it smell? Okay, he's not leaking. That's the good news. The bad news is there is mold on the outside. Oh no! Oh no! Can you see? Oh yeah! Whoa! The little white bits. So, you know, this is why we have to do this again. Yeah. While Bean showed promise, he was not perfect. All right, so the very first step in this process will be to assemble this giant mold box. Um, I made it out of massively thick HGPE, which is good for resin, and it's just, it's just, it just makes me happy. It's, 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 it's cool. <laughs> Why does it make you happy? Because it's like, it's so freaking thick. Yeah. <laughs> Thick. Right. We, we really didn't want the resin to like bow out to yeah. the sides, so. Right. Let's get screwing. Box is done. We also added an acrylic top so that dust doesn't get in. Yeah, but do we trust this box enough to not leak resin? No. So we're also gonna seal the outside edges with hot glue. Oh, our fake window is off. Oh no, oh no. Oh, the sun oh. just decided to shine through. <laughs> wow, yeah, 9.30 p.m. I'll be your ammo, ammo boy. Thank you, ammo boy. Yeah, even more, even more. Is the one thick. Yeah, oh my gosh, it's steaming. Well, cause it's 100 watts. <laughs> yeah, that's epic. Maybe we should turn it down, that was steaming. I, you know I am always a proponent for turning it down and you're the one that's like, 100 watts. <laughs> oh. Sorry. There, there you go. <laughs> I thought you were just having like a romantic moment with me, like where you guide my hands. Wait, stick around. <laughs> Sorry, it came out. <laughs> trying to have a romantic moment with you. <laughs> <laughs> what, I told you to stick it in. <laughs> <laughs> Now we don't want to carve our pumpkin, set it in here and cover it with resin because then at the base of the pumpkin, the butt will be bare. The butt will be bare and it can rot and we don't want that. So we are going to be doing a layer of resin at the very bottom before we do anything, which brings us to the very first of many, many. Resin time, resin time, do, 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 resin time. I'm very proud to announce that today, finally, we have remembered mold release. <laughs> oh my gosh. Should we do this outside? It's 1020. So. Man, I just didn't get in my cool pants. Right, well, I hope your pants weren't ruined by that spray. <laughs> You're wearing your nice ones. I know. Maybe I'll just be like waterproof now. Yeah, Nothing yeah, yeah. Nothing will stick to me. <laughs> yeah. I'm just slick. <laughs> slick Caitlin. Here goes the very first layer. 
Mm. Oh no. What? Level it. <gasps> we can do that now. We're fine. We can do that now. Well, we'll let this cure and then tomorrow we can start on the pumpkins. Yeah. <laughs> this is the one that's gonna get uh no resin. He's in the control. Have you picked a name? I have picked a name that can go for either. Yam. <laughs> Yam. Yam the pumpkin. Meatball. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So like that could really yeah, only be I mean, him because I mean, he's so round. So round, yeah. Okay. Meatball and yam. Yeah. Have we told them what we're doing to their butts yet? Oh, no, we haven't yet. <laughs> okay, maybe we start there. The typical is you carve out the top of a jack-o'-lantern. When yeah. you're done, you reach down from the top and put the light in. Yeah. We obviously can't do that when he's covered in resin. So if we want to put a light in there, the hole has to be from the underside. It's a, it's a bottom hole. It's a bottom hole. It's the, the bee hole. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna use this giant hole saw. Woo! <laughs> Do you want to knock? Woo! Oh, it's <laughs> really getting on you and everything. Oh my God. It's getting on you too. Hold on. I mean, we need to clean me before. No, you're just gonna be messy. I'm not worried about you. I'm worried about the camera. No. You, you just stay put. You're gonna be my anchor. Come here. No, I'm cleaning myself. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> All right, hey! Hey. That was easy. Whoa, it's, all it's a the, big plug. It's all, it's, it's, it's all of the, no, not Kaylin. It's all the, 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 the strings, oh my gosh. Oh yeah, because they're attached to the base. Goodbye. Goodbye. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Imagine how it feels to be meatball right now. Yeah. But you're gonna be forever. Meatball forever. Meatball is all ready to go. Do you wanna use the reciprocating saw or do you wanna use traditionals this year? Reciprocating saw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, baby. It's so much faster. I can't go back. Like we, we have pumpkin carving scheduled with some friends this year and we're debating bringing the tools. How cool would it be to show up at pun pumpkin carving with this? Exactly. Oh you should put on safety gloves. I was just about to say like, do I need to raise the camera? You're gonna get cut off. No. I'm just your height now. <laughs> no, you're not. You're still shorter. <laughs> you should. This is great. Teamwork. No! <laughs> <laughs> the hole's only that big. That's the hole? I mean, this has got to be thin, right? You it's know? really thin. It's I'm just really gonna thin. like yeah, enlarge there it. There you go. <laughs> I opened it up and I was like, "It's a solid pumpkin." <laughs> yeah. oh, the mist, the pumpkin mist. Yeah, no more We're ready to carve now. I'm gonna start again with power tools. I will too. <laughs> <laughs> the cutest little eyes. I know. Just so perfectly circular. <laughs> Cute. There we go. Oh, such a concerned boy. As you should be. Yeah. You aren't getting the eternal resin juice. Or maybe he's being spared. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It could go either way. We have like a 50-50 rate of who got it worse. Our next step was to drill an air hole for Meatball, because if we didn't, there would be a trapped air pocket as the resin fills up the box. The air hole lets resin displace the air. We then put UV resin on both sides of a brass tube to temporarily plug it while we paint on a thin coat of resin to try to preserve him as early as we can, since filling up the cube will take several days. Well, we're gonna be at this like probably for the rest of the day. Yeah, this is our afternoon. This is, this is one of the more tedious parts of the project. Look at our boy. Look at Meatball. Meatball is looking real nice, but I am also noticing, what's up with all of the like pale, whitish something happening? 
it's okay if things are happening here because the whole purpose of this video is the experimentation. Yeah. Not the end result necessarily. <laughs> so, you know, it's fine. He is ready to be embedded fully. But first, we have to drill that little drain hole. Ooh. Is that pumpkin? Where is the juice coming from? Uh, Hello? That was going into a, a brass tube that we sealed with resin. How? Maybe it was, maybe the holes weren't fully sealed? They seemed fully sealed. Yeah, but okay. what the heck, how is there a juice in there? I don't know, I don't know. That's a juice mystery. I'm down to just proceed. Yeah. Let's just get him. Let's just get him in his resin bath. His life preserving resin bath. <laughs> yeah. We actually had to have like calls with Total Boat before this. Yeah, we're just like... to like talk through our game plan and make sure it would work. Shout out to Total Boat for being true supporters. Yeah. Right, ready? Yep. We so much resin. Oh my god! This feels wrong! I know! Like, every instinct in me is like, that's gonna start smoking. I think I got the level perfectly precise. Oh my precise. god. Look at that. It is so thick. Do you think this would fit in the vacuum chamber? Uh, no. We could do it in two separate batches and two smaller buckets. Let's do it for the first one and, we'll and see. see how much it bubbles. Okay. Wow, who are we? Leveling? Mold release? Vacuum chamber? I know. Oh yeah, look at those bubbles. Yeah, I feel like this is necessary. That was a lot. Whoa, whoa, it's whoa, rising. whoa, It's rising, it's rising a lot. Do you want to turn that off? Whoa! Oh my oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god! Look at that! So, um, are we just gonna do a bunch of rounds of this? Okay. Okay, it's time. It's finally time. Meatball! You're going home. Forever. Your new home. Your forever home. Do you want I, a stool? I didn't think you this need through. a stool. You need the stool. <laughs> <laughs> you take much joy in this. Watch your head. Okay. This is a nice little bath. Is, is he uh, centered? Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now. Nothing is perfect. Everything is organic. He's and, a pumpkin. And that's okay. Yay! He's in the resin. Yeah, we just have five more days of this. <laughs> yeah. Sleep tight, meatballs. See you tomorrow. But first, a quick announcement. We are doing our first ever limited time merch drop with our new Words Are Hard floral design, which you can find at shopevancaitlin.com. Shop. Shop Evan, shop Evan and Caitlin.com. Come on, Caitlin. Caitlin personally and painstakingly designed all of those tiny little flowers to make up the letters, and you can get it on tees, hoodies, mugs, and stickers. But this design will only be available for two weeks between now and November 18th. So if you want something for yourself or as a gift, make sure to snag it now. Again, that is shop Evan and Caitlin.com to check it out. Thanks, bye. All right, guys, it's been 24 hours since the very first extra deep pour, and I'm not confident that we can do the next one yet. It's definitely still, one, goopy, yeah. two, warm, and it hasn't started cooling yet. And this is an issue because we're going out of town in like a week, and so there's not much wiggle room if we need to pour one of these per night. Yeah, because I think we're gonna have to pour more than this for the next layer. It's, but like that might make it kick too fast and we ruin the whole thing. It's like, we're and stuck in this And that's the problem with leaving town. Conundrum. Don't leave home ever. I think we just have to wait till morning and hope that it is cured enough. All right, it's next morning, and we just checked the resin temperature. It's at 85, guys. That means it's time for the next resin coat. This yeah. might work, this might work. <laughs> and hopefully that means this is the last time you'll see us until this cube is full. Disaster has struck. We were just getting ready to do the next resin pour on meatball, and I looked over and I was like, hey, did you did you move Yam? Where's Yam? Okay, we had sent him here to take photos of his progress. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, there's juice everywhere. Dude, I literally yesterday put a to-doist item in. Add a 
plastic sheet and a juice shield because like he wasn't looking so great. Oh, Caitlin, this is gonna be a mess. Oh, 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 oh what oh, the heck? What What the heck? Oh, I'm, oh, I'm so scared. There's pumpkin juice all over the floor. He knocked the light crooked. Oh my God, he's full of mold. He's full. Oh, oh I'm getting sick. I don't have childhood memories of them rotting this fast. Yeah, this is insane. Like, do we just have a bad effect? Oh my God, it's full, it looks like cat hair. Oh my gosh. What? We this, really is, this has lasted, like, how, how long has this been? Four days? What the heck? God. Our control. Oh my, oh, oh I see the juice. I you see the juice. Oh, I see the juice. Oh, I see it. And oh, look, there's so many different it. types oh. of mold. There's like the black one and then the white one. You know, we were gonna do a whole little thing like we normally do where we have the two pumpkins side by side. I don't think this is gonna happen anymore. Yam has failed us. Yam, you're going in the trash. Yeah, yam is trash. <laughs> you know, he had a short life. He knew from the beginning he was gonna die what he thought would be a natural death. It maybe didn't last quite as long as we hoped, but... You made a point about the fragility of life. He did. It's all falling into his mouth. Ugh. Man, I still can't believe Yam. I know. What a tragic death. Alrighty, more excitement. I, I, I've had enough excitement. Um, but we have a little issue with the resin. Yeah, so we wanted to fill the resin up to just under the eyes. Because we needed both the eyes and air hole to be covered during a single pour layer for the resin to displace the air. But the angle we drilled the eyes at and the thickness of the pumpkin is actually sealed right now at this moment. So we actually need to start scooping resin out. Yeah. <laughs> Which isn't what we plan to do, but we can do it. <laughs> Pain. Pain. You know, I've always wanted to cast the inside of a bucket. Wow, me too. Yeah, so this is great. This is great. I feel no pain. Now it's time for the pour where hopefully resin will be able to flow into the eyes and fill the pumpkin head. It's slowly going up. The level's slowly going up. All right, it's covered. Is it gonna let any bubbles out? Or did it like perfectly fill from both ends at the same time? I don't see any bubbles. Is that good or bad? I don't know. Did we do it? Was that it? Should we like poke into it? Let's poke into it. Oh, bubbles came out, bubbles came oh, out. Bubbles came out, okay, so it might have been a little clogged. You see those bubbles? Oh, oh yeah, I see the bubbles. Oh no. What? You know how I was worried the resin went up too high? Like right like now- Like the resin touched the inside of the tube? Yeah, the, on, the, on the inside. Can we drill it out again? No, we can't. <sighs> yeah, the resin sealed the bottom of the tube. I can't believe it! Uh, what if it's fine? What if it's fine? I don't see how it could be fine. Well, well, okay, so there's a pocket of air in there, but like, what if that's fine? If there is like bacteria or mold spores or whatever in that air, if we're cutting it off from the flow of oxygen now, is that okay? Or will it be like a terrarium? Can we get something and then just no, like just like submerged in resin, would be slapping the resin around. You guys, what do we do? <laughs> I think, you know, let's try the pokey pokey method. And if that doesn't work, then there's an ecosystem in there and that's okay, we tried. So you're gonna make like an angled poker? Yep. I used to just like mangle these hangers when I was a kid and just make random things. Well, you get to relive your childhood today. Yes. Oh, very nice pokey. Come on. Can't work with that. Oh. You know, I'll narrate the best I can. <laughs> uh, 
He's poking resin. <laughs> He's poking the wire through the tube into the sealed plug of resin. From the expression on his face, I can tell it's not going well. And it's not like we can disassemble the mold box temporarily since there's wet resin in there. Trying to think like what I can sacrifice to like make things possible. What if I manually drilled? Like, oh my god. <laughs> oh, geez. Oh. Oh, oh, got on my shirt. Can you wipe me off? <laughs> And you're gonna have to get some acetone. Oh, geez. Wait, was there bubbles coming out? No. Everything is slippery. Slippery with a substance that you really don't want to get on you. You look comfortable, at least. Oh, 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 wait, there's bubbles, more bubbles are coming. Oh, oh. Did, it, did it go? Oh, more bubbles, more bubbles. Oh my oh, it's god. Oh, in, yeah. You did oh, it. I was oh just about god. to like give up. We're gonna have to give you an acetone bath. Here, oh we'll yeah, I see it. it, I see it, I see it. Maybe we need to pour more resin in. We could pour more resin in. To increase the pressure on the air yeah. and make oh, it escape. Okay, more Let's resin. Let's do it, more resin. No, I thought this whole thing would be like a chill process doing the deep pour. Oh, I, mean, I was looking forward to like, like, hey, we'll have like five full chill days of pouring resin. No big deal. Yeah, no big deal. We'll just record some top-down footage and yeah. it'll be a little time lapse. I need a massage. Yeah, me too. Hi, I'm a photographer. I take photos. I need a photographer. Can I see your work? Oh no, I don't have a website. So basically, I preserve pumpkins and resin. It's kind of my life's work. I'd like to order a hundred of those. What's your website? Oh no, I don't have a website. Don't let tragic events like this happen to you. Instead, use today's sponsor, Squarespace, for all your website needs. In addition to letting you set up an online store or a portfolio of your work, you can also set up member-gated content like courses or newsletters. Plus, if you offer in-store pickup, you can build that into your website. And you can create pro-level videos in their Video Studio app to make content for your customers. You can even buy whatever domain you want on Squarespace. So go to squarespace.com for a free trial, and when you're ready to pull the trigger, go to squarespace.com slash Evan and Caitlin for 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. That's squarespace.com slash Evan and Caitlin. Oh man, guys, I was not planning to film right now. I was just gonna do another resin pour, but I noticed something. Look at that. What's going on? What the heck is going on? Also, look, there's like white. There's like a line of white all the way around him. Where's that going? Caitlin! Oh no. Meatball's dying. What? Look. He's, he's shrinking away from the resin. Also look here, look at the juice bubbling. Do you see the juice bubbling? Oh my God, yes. It's bubbling. He's, he's juicing inside the shell. He's juicing inside the shell. We, should, we shouldn't have ever added the hole. I, that was my idea, I think it was a bad idea. I think that might have added like a weak point or like you know, everything was going okay until yesterday's fiasco. He's losing his bright orange luster. He's dying. The, the whole point was not to die, Meatball. Why are you dying? My prediction is, you know how with <laughs> Francis, similar things started happening and he pulled away from the resin so much that it cracked, let in more air, and then it was a disaster. Yeah. If we can seal it up before it gets to the disastrous point, maybe it won't get worse than this. But let's just, let's just try it. Yeah. Let's just try it. <laughs> Resin time, resin time, do, 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 resin time. I'm just gonna do the best that I can and that's all I can do, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's still bubbling, I see it, stop bubbling. I still see it bubbling as I pour this. We're gonna seal it in. We can only <laughs> battle nature so much. So is this our last layer? No, we probably have one more after this. 
Oh no. Oh guys, today is just such a day. Oh no, oh my God, wait, I gotta grab my mask. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh no! That's all resin. Oh, jeez. <sighs> um. It's fine. Is it fine though? How, it's fine. How are we gonna clean? How are we gonna clean it's the washing It's fine. <laughs> Hey, Vsauce. Uh, um. <laughs> this project's defeating me, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, I did this through my inattention. What were you paying attention to? I don't know, I think I was just standing here spacing out. <laughs> <laughs> More bubbles are, are coming out and then more form. So there's still an active leak at the stem. <laughs> no, 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 no. Guys, it just never stops. We covered everything and the juice is still leaking. So everything is going to be fine. But. That's a lot of bubbles and warping. And? And juice. <gasps> juice! No! It's still juicing! No! Earlier today, earlier today, I came out and everything was fine. Everything was fine. And then juice. How, did, how is the juice seeping through I don't solidified know. resin? This I is don't solidified. Know. Did the bubbles create like a, well, thought, like a pathway? This, this, this is what I was thinking. As it was curing, juice was trying to escape. So like the liquid buried a path out as it was curing. So the juice had created like a tunnel through the resin. A juice tunnel. Let's do a UV resin moment. Well, yeah, let's cure it. All right, so I'm gonna soak up the juice. Yeah. UV resin first. Yes. But then do we do we do a that. fast cure, and then we do a deep pour. Why? We, just because, like, I want this to be done. I want. I want. I want to be done. Just so I'm like clear on the theory here, and to communicate <laughs> to everyone watching. I want to be extra sure. UV resin should be enough. But just in case, I want to really quickly seal it with fast cure resin because. The super deep cure resin that we've been using oh. cures so slow that the that juice a... can escape and make a tunnel. Exactly. But fast cure resin should mm. be pretty fast. Stops the leak finally, please. Yeah, I was gonna say you're we're hoping. Please. Okay, UV first. Resin time. No resin time. No more resin time. <laughs> I know. Alrighty. Well, I don't see much juice coming up, but who knows, the seal might breach at any moment. But hey, even if we seal in some bubbles, you know, it tells a story. It tell, it's, 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 a, it's, a, it's a style choice. What is this going to look like when we demold it? <laughs> it's going to be unique. You know, it's certainly not going to be what I imagined. I can tell that just from the top view right now. A bright, healthy orange pumpkin? Yeah. No, no. it's definitely not going to be that. No. No. Resin time! Do 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 do! Resin time! Boop! Final resin pour. It's finally happening. And we barely got it done before our trip. We have one spare day. Yeah, one day until we go to TwitchCon. I'm gonna seal it up. We seal it up. We'll come back from our trip. Have a little worried because on our very first pumpkin, we left for a trip and we came back to disaster. How you know. can this mess up more? Than it already has. Than it already has. Exactly. At this point, it is what it is. Now, will we come back to like a rotted black mess? That's what I'm saying. You know, we weren't quite as fast, but at least we got some snacks. So I'm yeah. still happy. Got to eat. Yeah.
All right, we're back from TwitchCon. It was so nice meeting some of you guys and making some new friends. But now it's time for us to check on the friend that we left at home. Have you looked at Meatball? A little bit. It doesn't look good. He looks... He looks almost frozen. He, he looks white. Yeah. Zoom <laughs> tilt him. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what have we done? What have we done? Hey, did it leak though? It did not leak. That was the one thing that didn't go wrong. Wait. Oh. Oh, it's like going right now. It's coming apart. It's good. It's gonna do it. <gasps> Wait, why is it cloudy? It's cloudy. It's supposed to be glossy. Well, we can always add a gloss so that we can see through it. We can right? add a gloss. We'll we can add, add a gloss. gloss. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Another panels. I mean, but at the same time. His face is still cute. For the most part, things are working. They are, except everything that didn't. Oh, oh, he's coming out. Oh, he's coming out. Oh, boy. Hey, hey boy. Oh, my God. <laughs> Hi. How are you doing in there? Hi, Meatball. He's so jolly, yet so... <laughs> morbid. Uh, morbid. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We have a little bit of work to do. First off. Meet our son. Meatball. <laughs> I think that the little name tag Yes, you can see the layer lines. Yes, he wasn't perfectly preserved. You can see, like, he started, like, rotting more or delaminating from the resin more, like, partway up. Yeah, but with the, with the right lighting, things look a lot different. Let me show you. Ta-da! Now you don't see all the imperfections as much. He just looks like a glorious little jack-o-lantern. Which is kind of what we wanted. Like, <laughs> yeah. am I slightly disappointed about certain things that happened? Yes. <laughs> am I brainstorming things we could have done differently? Yes. But at the same time, he does look kind of glorious. I really hope that he stays at least in this state forever. Isn't that right, Meatball? You're going to be with us forever. 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 All right, it's been 26 days. This is where we've been getting the time-lapse photos and I've been doing them all. Caitlin hasn't seen the result yet. No. Go for it. <laughs> it's kind of the exact same, right? Yeah. Though he built it up, I thought maybe he, it would be different. <laughs> no, he's perfect! Oh, God! <laughs> <laughs> like, the only thing that's changed is like the water level has risen. He's oh, just, the white line? Oh yeah, the white line right there. You'll have to wait to see how things hold up at the one year mark when we'll do an update then. Oh, meatball. <laughs> so snuggly. <laughs> You are awesome for watching this long. You get bonus points. If you've watched this long, you probably like this video, so you might be interested in the video that started it all where we made Francis, or the second video in the series where we made Bean, who's a year old. Wow, they grow up so fast. All right, see you next time. Okay, bye. Okay, thanks, bye. Okay, bye. Bye, bye now, bye.